everyone and welcome to the Stocks with Show Play of the Day. This is MDR. It was a nice gap today, a good solid gap today. And I knew the market was going to be very strong today. So I chose to take uh, pretty much uh, rinky-dink targets on things today. I said, you know, listen, we're just doing moves. We're not doing any dream targets and anything today. Because really, the stock played out beautifully today and should be at $7 or almost below it now. But it's not why market's too strong. So I played this perfectly today with the entry and the exit and everything got out even near the low of the day. And it's not like this is not going to get to $7 ever, but the idea of playing this down to a dream target today doesn't really make sense against this bullish market. Called the market very well, and I'll do a market video later today as well. But let's go over the play of the day here in MDR. This is a little skewed here because this really doesn't look like this from yesterday. It's just the way that my charting system is. It really closed around, I think it was 8.11, 8.10. This is like where this closed yesterday, like here. So pretend that's there. And anyways, we gapped down then today. So the rate of the gap was a nice gap. I forget the rating on this. Uh, let me see. 20. Just barely made the grade, but 20 or more, it's good. Okay? So did it. Did it right out of the gate. And the one thing I said was today, market very, very bullish. I need to see immediate weakness. Immediate weakness. Absolutely right. Immediate. Boom. Because once the market starts setting its tone, if things are not going to go right, they're not going to go right on a day where the market's still going to power trend all day. And that's exactly how the market's playing out. It's power trending since the open. So you've got to get the plays early before the market sets in that tone of the day. I saw it before it happened, but... You know, you really got to get the plays in the morning quickly if you see that the market's going to power trend. So it's different when the market's strong. A power trend is something completely different. But let's talk here about the MDR. MDR was beautiful. It was great. It was wonderful. Fantastic. I loved it. Got the play in here, entered here at 7.56, and it did have a four-penny spread in the morning. I don't think this does anymore. No, it's a penny. But it had a four-penny spread in here in the morning. So I also was a little herky-jerky, and so I gave it a cushion. Gave it a cushion and took it on down. Boop. And this actually is still holding. Crazy as it sounds, if you are still in this with a stop at 756, 757, you're, you could still be in this trade. I really honestly am not sure if it gets down to the dream target today because of the market. It's quarter of one. The market closes in two hours and 20 minutes. And just low odds today for follow through to big targets for things. But this has another day in it. So watch this for tomorrow to break further. But I got this whole thing this morning. That was it. Great move. And did the right thing by getting out. Stock actually rallied all the way back. Set up twice again. And, and, and again, this is lower on the daily chart. Lower on the daily chart, I really, $7 on any normal day would not be a dream target. But today, because of everything that was happening with the market, it was. So I said, first move, first play, brawl out. And that's the way I played it. But you could be in this for a move down overnight to take it down lower. It's It should not only get to 7, but break 7. So this is even a core short here. Target $6. But for a day trade, it was a nice move. And again, nice clean move. As soon as I'm in it, I'm up. As soon as I'm in it, I'm up. It's working. I go. You're in it. You let it drive on down. You're out. That's it. 10 minutes trade is done. Beautiful way to start the morning. And what is today? Tuesday. Yeah. Got Wednesday, Thursday, Friday left for the week. So nice start to the month here in March. Getting solid, solid picks, solid entry, solid moves. And we'll see where we go from here. This is Melissa with the thestockswish.com. It is Tuesday, March 4th. The Golden Gap class is this weekend, March 8th and 9th. And if you'd like more information and signing up for that course, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Remember, training is about consistently. Consistency. Consistently finding trades that set up and going to work. You've got to find the right stocks to trade, get the entries correct, and take the positions correct and get out correctly. You have to do it all. Find the right stock, the right entry, the right stop, the right position size, and the right exit. And if you do that, you can make money consistently in the market. Many people that think that it cannot be done and believe that trading is gambling don't have a system that works because it is about the consistency Taking it and doing it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, every day that you get up and you see it and you hit it. That's not to mean that you don't lose money one or two days a month. 
where there might or there might be nothing to do one day a month. But for the most part, you know that every day you're going to get something to do. You know that your system works. You feel confident and lots of conviction in what you do, like me. And so if you're looking for a strategy in a system like that, then you can reach out to me and I can teach you what I do. I have a high level of conviction in my calls, uh, just like I do about my gaps, the market, everything. And I can teach you how to learn how to read charts in this way that you can get the conviction yourself to because you need this to make money in the market. You need to have something that's good and you need to believe that it works so that you can press the button and hit it. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. Have a fantastic day, everybody. Email me at Melissa at the StockSwish.com if you'd like more information. Have a good one.